O M G. I can't eat anything. <laughs> ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> uh, I really can't. Check out the SpongeBob boxers. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Smooth operator. No, but seriously. Um, I love cereal in the morning. And I love bacon and eggs and toast. That's usually what I cook. And I'm so hungry. But I can't eat anything. Because my teeth hurt so bad. And the way that they did the new brackets on my teeth, I can't bite. Like, that's where I'm not, you can't really see it. But my bite stops at a weird spot. It's like my mouth is still open, kind of. Uh, it's just excruciating. Excruciating pain. And I love my, I love my cereal. Like there's peanut butter crunch over there, and I have to like hold it in my mouth and make it soggy before I can eat it. And then I have Quaker natural granola, and you know, you know that's gonna be hard to crunch through. So I gotta put like some hot milk in it or something. I'm gonna try to experiment with that today. But yeah. So maybe I'll lose weight faster. <laughs> Cause I'm starving! I'm starving. I'm gray. I'm so hungry, I'm from... Hungary. I'm Hungarian. <laughs> you guys like my cool satin cap? It stays on all night because... Magic. So it's like a magic material or something. I was like, I don't know about all that, but okay. As long as it stays on. My hair looks crazy under here. I decided to brush it, like, <laughs> up last night. Brush it up to the side. Oh, this is so sexy. This is the sexiness 101. Alright, I'm putting this back on. <laughs> I got a new fish, well, a new fish and a crab. My new fish is a dragonfish, and he's crazy. He looks like he's dead most of the time because he just, he just lays there. He swims really fast though. Like I think he's laying there so that he can like gather up his energy for when he needs to escape. And right now he's about that long. And he's going to be 20 inches at his full grown state. So I need to get a bigger fish tank eventually. Because right now I have a 14 gallon and I should have at least a 25 gallon. But they say 50 gallon is like optimal because of the size. And then I have a fiddler crab. And oh wait, my dragonfish's name is Puff. And it's funny because me and Danielle thought of it at the same time. Like oh what's this name going to be? And then we were like Puff same time well kind of at the same time I was thinking it at the same time she said it and then I said it right after like a second after anyway and it's cool because his name is fitting because when he's eating his mouth goes <laughs> and he like puffs so yeah puff magic dragon and then I have a fiddler crab <laughs> and it's cool because like if you've ever seen Finding Nemo he does the whole like you remember they were eating bubbles and like they were like and he'll like scrape the rocks and everything looks like I have a hunchback <laughs> he'll um scrape the rocks and then like scrape 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 in the books and he like eats really fast and it's so cute and his name kind of came about on accident because uh, I was like where's Mr. Crab and I was just saying, like, Mr. Crab, like, you know, Mr. Fish. Mr. Fish, did you die? <laughs> um, and then Daniel was like, oh, that is that what you named him, Mr. Crab? Like, off of SpongeBob. I was like, no, but that's cool. I'll name him Mr. Crab. It's, like, so not original, but I like it. So, yeah, Mr. Crabs and Puff. 
awesome. Kind of looks like I have a beauty mark right here. That'd be really cool. But it's actually, it's actually a, a scab. <laughs> Sexy. Yeah. Okay. Ugh. I'm not standing yet. I am kneeling. I'm going to try to semi stand every video. Because <laughs> some people don't believe I have. Bye.